Gun culture guy. All right, 700 yards. This is my long range. Okay, I got three 75, 175s, 75 grain. And we're gonna do these last because these are the tight ones. So I'll put this here to put on last because they could jam. Now, I don't know how many I got here. I probably got about four or five or six or somewhere around there. And we got the, uh, those are 62. I think those are match. Okay. Now, we're gonna, uh, say, well, actually, these things are kind of tight too, aren't they? Um, hmm, interesting. Here, I thought this thing was gonna be loose. Uh, anyway, what are we gonna say? Taiwan, piston driven out to that distance, 16 inch barrel, Taiwan 90, 91 upper, which is a wolf, call him wolf, same thing. All right. Savage lower. And we're gonna see what the drop is because I was pretty well on, actually aiming low at uh, 280 yards. Now this is a much farther distance. We're gonna see some drop. So this is a non-focal, doesn't have that. So this is a basic, uh, more basic uh, scope. I think it's a Bushman, a Bush, Bush, uh, what do you call that? Bushnell. But it is a four by uh, 12. Okay, I'm gonna raise that up. We're gonna see where I'm hitting. No end. Beautiful, I mean it's 70, probably 75. It's gonna be pushing about 80 right out here. We're gonna see where these 65s land at that distance. I'm raising up about a uh, uh, mil mark, about uh, three mil marks, four mil marks. We're still high. That's amazing. It could be right on. So I'm gonna aim right on it, or maybe just a tad under. Just to the right, that could have been me. I'm actually aiming under. So this is set too high. Wow, 700 yards. And we're gonna crank that down some. About four or five clicks down. I'm gonna aim on it. There you go. That's where I was aiming. Just above the target. Look at that. How much ammo we got left? Probably about five rounds or three rounds. And then we're gonna go into one set. These, these 62s are up. That's, five, that's 700 yards. This thing is accurate. There you go. Got a hit. Wow. No wind and this thing is just, this thing is on for 62 grain. Uh, low on that one. I think we're down the two, oh, we got two more rounds. Okay, that one dropped. Could have been the reloader. <laughs> We know, we know who that is. You know, I don't, I think I might've went to the left on that. I might've pulled slightly. Last round of 62. Yeah, I pulled on that one to the left. I felt a little flinch. So, now, these 170, 175s, should shoot a lot lower, should drop. So I will aim above the target on this one. I'm kind of curious, these are really tight in the chamber. So, uh, I think I'm still to the left. Give me one click to the right, to the right maybe. If I can get this. You know, that was really low. That one really ran out of gas. So, let's aim higher. Last shot, probably hit high, watch this. But I'm gonna aim about a couple feet over. Still to the left a little bit, ain't it? It appears that these are either drifting to the left. Um, I don't know, unless I pulled that badly. But, uh, 
We're going to make one click to the right next time we come out. And that, uh, you know what? It doesn't like 75s. <laughs> well, it doesn't like my reloads, maybe. Um, these were, uh, I don't know how hot they were. They're a little on the undercharge. So, there you go. Uh, it likes 62. So there you are. Taiwanese like 62. Let's pick up my brass here. Uh, There's a lot of hits here. I don't know what's going on here. Uh, okay, here we go. Um, that's definitely a new one. Right through the bottom of the can. Okay, where it was placed, I don't know. You know what? I think that was it there. This is an old one. This has been shot up before. I forgot to change it up. So, this one is interesting. Now, it caught, it nicked the bottom, so that can was to the left, I think to the right still. I might have pulled probably. But it actually penetrated and zipped through it. Now, that was, I assume that's the uh, 62 grain. So, moral of the story is, that's a military barrel. So, not nothing fancy. I think it likes the 62s better because it's more set up. The twist rate, I think it's a 1 in 7. But, uh... We'll find out. It doesn't look like, like 75, big big slug, so I might end up using the 62s in that from now on, which is fine. And then use the 75s and 77s in the Alex Pro. We're gonna continue on and test it out.